Welcome to creating PostgreSQL databases. This is a fundamental topic for anyone who is an administrator or user of PostgreSQL. During this course, we will explore the required commands for creating databases and their underlying components, fundamental data types in PostgreSQL, database normalization, and the management of database access. This course will jumpstart your journey to becoming an expert PostgreSQL administrator. PostgreSQL is an object relational database system. This focus on objects is fundamental to the organization of this software. The components of the software, some of which we will be discussing in this course, are considered objects. The highest level object is a database. PostgreSQL provides a simple command for creating a new empty database to be populated with data. The command is quite straightforward. The words create and database are followed by the name of a database and a semicolon to end the command. It is worth noting that the words create database do not need to be capitalized as SQL is not a case sensitive language. Uppercasing all letters improves readability. DB underscore name represents the name of the database that we are creating. By default, database names cannot be longer than 31 characters and must start with a letter or underscore like these examples show. However, database names cannot start with numbers like this. When might you be interested in creating a new database? You can think of a database as a collection of data that is connected by relationships which exist between the entities represented by the data. For example, if you are a sports fanatic and are interested in doing some analysis on college basketball stats, you might create a database to store the data to be analyzed in a database named NCAA underscore BB. This database might contain data for players, games, and colleges. Or maybe as an owner of a car dealership, you want to keep track of the inventory on your lot former and prospective customers, and salespeople on your team in a database named auto underscore depot. Perhaps you were starting a company to produce podcasts. You might want to organize your podcast by characteristics such as host, topic, delivery platform, and subscribers. This database could be called pod. As you can see, there are many possible reasons for wanting to create and maintain a database. Before moving on to the discussion of setting up other objects in PostgreSQL databases, let's practice using the create database command.